Uh, it, it, quantum entanglement is really only weird because you think of two objects, two particles originally together, and they're part. You think of them as two separate objects. But if they ha if they were entangled to begin with, and nothing has interfered with them as they evolved, then they're really part of part of a, a single quantum mechanical whole. It's not too surprising when you pull the tail on a cat that its face is not ha happy. What what's happened is that they're in a, that you have a quantum mechanical configuration. These particles are created entangled, but that doesn't mean we know exactly what configuration they're in. Say, take an electron and a two electrons in an angular momentum zero state where one spin is pointing up and one spin is pointing down. But they, there are lots of directions they can be pointing in in which they're pointing in the opposite direction. And it turns out the electrons are doing all of that at the same time because they're in the superposition of those states. And then as you move apart, well, what happens is I measure one of them and that and my measurement tells me which direction it's pointing in. But that implies the other one must be pointing in the other that other direction. Yeah. So I fix this and instantaneously that other particle, if measured at the same time, will be pointing in the other direction. 